we will discuss about another place value system that is known as international place value system. In this system, we use periods. Here, international system chart is given. In this, we use periods, once period, thousandth period, million period. And each period have three places. Once period have three places that is ones, tens, hundreds. Thousand periods have three places that is thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand. Again, millions periods have also three places that is one million, ten million and hundred million. Let us take an example. Five, 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 eight, zero, two, three, six. How can we write this number? This number can be written as 5,5802,236. And how can we write this number? We can write this number as 5,580,236. Now, we will discuss rounding of numbers. Rounding of numbers as in the previous class you learn you have learned about rounding of numbers why we use rounding of numbers to make them look simple and easy to remember another one the number is close to the original print let us take an example round of 93 lakh 8687 to the nearest thousand so for rounding of this number we have to follow some rules first of all check the number at the thousand place 8 is at the 1000 place. Now look the number at the 100 place. If number at the 100 place is equal to 5 or greater than 5, then we give carry to the number that is at the 100 place, 1000 place. So here 6 is at the 100 place and 8 is at the 1000 place. 6 is greater than 5, so we give 1 carry to the 8 and its answer is 93 lakh 9000 let us take another example if we want to round off this number then uh, to nearest 1000 place then the answer is 93 lakh 8000 why because at the thousand place the number is 8 and at the hundred place the number is 4. 4 is less than 5. So we can't give carry to 8. So that's why its answer is 93 lakh 8000. Next is number patterns. Patterns can be very easily seen in numbers. Let us take an example. If you add the digits from of each number from 10 to 18, what will you get? When we add the digits from 10 to 18, when you add 10, the digits of 10 means 1 plus 0 answer is 1. Similarly, 11, 1 plus 1, 2. 12, 1 plus 2 is equal to 3. 13, 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. 14, 1 plus 4 is equal to 5. 15, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. 16, 1 plus 6 is equal to 7. 17, 1 plus 7 is equal to 8. And 18, 1 plus 8 is equal to 9. So, what will you observe? 
we observe that the sum that we get for uh, the counting from 1 to 9 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 so what we get we get the sum of the digits as 1 to 9 